A data profile is a powerful and efficient way to get a deeper understanding of a set of data. In this tutorial we will show how to quickly and easily create a data profile. We will be profiling the file name party underscore full dot text in the data slash in folder. We start by right clicking on the file and selecting create profile. We now need to make sure that the data is readable and formatted correctly. All the columns have been properly detected. One thing to confirm is the first row of records. If it contains column names, the relevant checkbox should be checked. Now that our input data looks OK, we'll click Next and move on to the Profile Configuration step. In this dialog, we are presented with some configuration options for the profile we want to create, such as where to create it, which columns to profile, and the types of statistics we want to generate. By default, it will profile all columns, generate all statistics, and create the profile in the same folder as the data file. If we want to add the ability to inspect the data records individually, we can use the drill through functionality, which stores additional information in a database. Next we have the option to create a profile file or a plan file. If we want to first perform some transformation on the data, or some advanced configuration of our profile, we can select plan file but now we will just create the profile. We'll click Finish and watch the progress in the console window. We have just profiled nearly 140,000 rows of data in just a few seconds. The profile is opened when finished. The profile consists of a summary of each row on the left and detailed profile data on the right. The Basic tab contains general summary statistics. The Frequency tab shows the number of times that each value occurs in the data. The Domains tab lists the domains to which the data belongs. Mask shows the pattern analysis of the data. Quantiles shows slices of the data when placed in order. And finally, Groups shows the number of times that each frequency count is repeated. For detailed information about how to read and understand the data presented in a profile, see our video tutorial on interpreting profile results. In this tutorial we have shown how to quickly create a data profile from a text file. A similar process can be followed to create a profile for data in database tables as well.